Hi everyone, my name is Anna. I am a fitness specialist at the Canada Game Centre and today I'm going to be demoing an AMRAP bodyweight workout for you. So AMRAP is A-M-R-A-P and it stands for as many reps as possible or as many rounds as possible. So what I'm going to do is give you a set amount of time, say 15 minutes, and I'm going to give you one circuit, say four exercises. Your goal is to do that circuit as many times as you can in 15 minutes. So you're going to take breaks as you need, so it's much more of a self-directed workout. And also remember to record how many times you get through the circuit. So when you do the workout again, you can try to beat that record. So again, this is a bodyweight workout, but you will need access to a chair or a sofa or some sort of chair-like object. And there is one exercise that involves stairs, uh, just running up and down stairs. If you don't have a set of stairs in your house, I will be giving an alternate for that. First things first, before we start into the workout, make sure you're nice and warmed up. So in the description of this video, there is a link for the CGC warm-up video. If you have not already done that or not already warmed up, please do that now. But starting into our first AMRAP. So AMRAP number one is going to be 15 minutes long and there are four exercises. So I'm just gonna take you through those four exercises. So first exercise is a 1.5 squat and you're going to do 10 of them. So the 1.5 squat is going down all the way, up halfway, down all the way, and then up the rest of the way. And that's one, you're gonna do 10. So again, down and up making sure that my core is engaged, my knees are staying out over my toes, I'm exhaling to stand up, and my hips are pushing back. So go as fast or as slow as you want. And then once you've done your 10, we're gonna come down to the ground and move right into push-ups. We're gonna do eight push-ups. So down from knees or toes, elbows come back, head looks or eyes look about two feet in front of you. Nice straight line. And again, option to drop the knees down. Elbows still going back, eyes still looking forward. After eight push-ups, we're gonna flip over. We're gonna do six leg lowers. So on your back, Feet up in the air, lower back pushed into the ground, lowering the legs down, and then back up. Only lower them down until you start to feel your lower back coming off the ground. So if that means you only go down to here, that's totally fine. Work through whatever range of motion works for you. After six of those, we're coming up. We're gonna do one set of stairs, or if you don't have stairs, you're gonna do 20 high knees. So feet are nice and light, hands are moving, knees are coming high. After 20 of those, you're right back into those 1.5 squats. So that's our first AMRAP. 15 minutes to do 10 1.5 squats, eight push-ups, six leg lowers, and then one set of stairs or 20 high knees as many times as you can. After that, you're gonna take a one to two minute break before we move on to the second AMRAP. So again, take breaks as you need. If you need to take a little bit of longer break in between the AMRAPs, feel free to do so. Our second AMRAP is about 12 minutes long and we have three exercises. So after your break, we're gonna start into our second AMRAP, starting with a Bulgarian split squat. So, finding your chair or your sofa or your elevated platform. We're gonna put your foot on the elevated platform. Toes can be uncurled or curled, whatever is most comfortable for you. We're gonna make sure that foot, the other foot is nice and far away from the chair. Chest stays upright. We're gonna do 10 Bulgarian split squats. So knee coming down and up. Again, making sure my chest stays forward. My eyes are looking forward. My front knee is staying right over top of my front foot. Inhaling down, exhaling up. 
After your 10, you're going to do the same thing on the other side. Switching feet. Again, toe can be curled or not. Make sure that front knee does not go over your front ankle. Again, work through whatever range of motion works best for you. If that means you're only going down a little bit, that's totally fine. Make sure you got your balance. And after your 10, release that foot. Come back to standing. We're going to do five burpees. So classic burpee, down to the ground, feet go back, push up, and then jump. Again, back, push up, and jump. Option to eliminate any of the jumping. Come off onto your toes instead. Or eliminate the push up. After five of those, we're going to come back down and we're going to do 10 mountain climbers. So my back is going to stay flat, knees coming into the chest. Short and sweet. That's our, our second AMRAP. So again, 10 Bulgarian split squats, each leg, five burpees, and 10 mountain climbers, as many times as you can in 12 minutes. After that, we'll take a one to two minute break, catch your breath, <laughs> which I need to do right now. <laughs> and <laughs> we'll move on to our third and final AMRAP. So our third AMRAP is nine minutes long, nice and short. And again, we've got three exercises. So after your one to two minute break, get ready for our last one. We're starting out with plank shoulder taps, 16 of them. So we're coming down, feet wide for stability, shoulders over the hands. We're gonna go 16 taps, that's eight per side. Option to bring the knees down, still making sure I have a nice straight line and trying to keep my hips as still as possible. After 16, we come up into 12 jump squats. So nice light feet. Option, of course, to eliminate the jump and just come up on your toes or just do a classic squat. After 12 of those, last exercise, tricep dips, eight of them. Hands come onto the seat, feet walk out, elbows go back, inhale down, exhale up. To make it easier, step the feet in, knees are bent, still pushing those elbows back for eight. And those are your three exercises for the AMRAP. That's 16 plank shoulder taps, 12 jump squats, and eight tricep dips. As many times as you can in nine minutes. So that is your AMRAP workout. After you're done, make sure you do the cool down. We do have a link to our cool down video in the description. And if there's anything in specific that you'd like us to do in these videos, please let us know in the comments. Thanks for watching. See you next time.